I'm Joe Schutz with Cal OES. 58 feet of snow, mobilized response teams from hundreds of miles away, and a resilient community. This is the story of Mono County. Emergency response teams were deployed in Mammoth Lakes for weeks. That pre-positioning proved vital during these historic storms. We've really got to yeah, thank our lucky stars that those teams were here. On multiple occasions, propane lines were compromised, filling homes with gas and causing them to explode. And it felt like a bomb went off. An explosion with zero casualties because of the urban search and rescue teams deployed from Southern California. That's only a snapshot of the disaster and response in Mono County. We've had big winters before. This was bigger than anything we've seen. Fortunately, we had people like you at OES that stepped in and brought us resources and things just as simple as firewood um, and propane and food and water. Mono County is in recovery, and with forecasted sunny weather ahead, recovery efforts are in full stride, making the need for the Disaster Recovery Center more important than ever. Miguel Urrera, a local restaurant owner, visited the Disaster Recovery Center after his building was damaged from the snow. In the moment that I walked in, there was, all, there was someone helping out, you know, asking questions. They were very helpful. They directed me to the right people. A resilient community paired with the right resources can make all the difference in the face of a disaster. I've been up in the Mammoth area for 21 years, 22 years now, and I've never seen anything like this. And the way that the community came together and the resiliency of the community was unreal. Um, anything that first responders, law enforcement, fire, Cal OES, anybody that was here, whatever we needed, they, 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 they wanted to help. They wanted to reach out and help out, and we couldn't have done it without our community. Bridgeport and Mammoth Lakes are only an hour apart, but Bridgeport is recovering from a different disaster. Most of those bags were deployed out here. Nick Way, interim fire chief for the Bridgeport Fire Department, detailed the disaster. After the snow, it warmed up, started to melt, and that's when the floods started. There's a lot of damage around town, and I, I think that damage is still occurring as the floods continue. Navigating Bridgeport is different after the floods. Sandbags line the streets, creating rivers between homes. In some cases, entire roads have been washed away. We got assistance from California State OES. Um, we had some neighboring agencies help. Uh, everybody really stepped up to the plate in that regard. Resilience, the common theme for Mono County. We're a little island in uh, Mono County. When we had Cal OES here, that was, that was big time for us. I mean, they literally saved lives. Um, they took a tremendous interest and care in our community. To learn more, visit news.caloes.ca.gov and follow us on all of our social media platforms.